Hi, this is Natalie Press, and you're watching 88 Seconds. Here we go. Blue's my favorite color. <laughs> oh, man. Who do you think is an underrated band, group, or artist? Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna say my friend Evan P. Donahue because he's from Milwaukee, but he lives in Nashville, and that's how I know him. We toured together back in the day, but I think he's one of the best songwriters ever. He's so clever and amazing. And I really hope he gets going. He's my favorite. What band instrument did you play in junior high or in high school? Oh man, I played keys. Uh, I had a band in middle school and I played keyboards. I had this Roland XP60 and they're so terrible that the worst sounds ever. <laughs> my middle school band was No Poppy and my high school band was Mon Chi Chi. I played a guitar in my high school band, Mon Chi Chi. Um, yeah, really embarrassing. <laughs> Favorite book, poem, or other piece of literature? I read the Lena Dunham book recently. That was the last full book I read, uh, Not That Kind of Girl, and it's just so inspiring, especially for women that are in kind of like the entertainment industry. She's really smart and cool, so I'm gonna say that one right now. It's the end of the world, yes. And you have time to grab one album. What album do you choose? I mean, this is kind of a given. I talk about this album all the time, but presenting Dionne Warwick. The moment I wake up. <laughs> it's like my life changer album. It's just like the perfect mix of instrumentation and songwriting. It's just like that perfect sweet spot of music for me. So I would do that one. Yay. Yeah. <laughs>